Hi, in this demo, we will talk about electronic signature in plant application web client. As you are aware, in manufacturing process, some of the critical parameters, actions, operations, activities require to be signed for audit trails before they are stored in database. Imagine the hassle of doing all those signature on paper and then sitting on a pile of paper to look for a specific signed item history. Pain, isn't it? Modern plant application web client ease out that pain it allows you to electronically sign a transaction for capturing a test value for a variable, both as a performer level as well as as a verifier level. Let's see how it works. To demonstrate electronic signature, we click on Activities app from Plant Application Web Client left hand side navigation menu. For this demo, I have created a time based sheet where I have configured some variables which require electronic signature, both for performer level as well as for verifier level. When you perform the activity, you will see the variables that require electronic signature are indicated with a pen indicator for electronic signature. The moment you, you capture a test value, you will be prompted for signing this test value in an electronic signature pop-up. This electronic signature pop-up, or you call it sliding window, will have two buttons which says authenticate performer and authenticate verifier. This variable require only performer level authentication. For variables that require performer as well as verifier level authentication will have a stepper icon in indicating the state of the transaction here on top. As a performer, I will authenticate myself and I'll be taken back to my e-signature window where it says performer authentication is successful. Now, I can add reason if I wish to for this particular electronic transaction. I can also add comments this comment is a rich text comment which allows all rich text formatting as well as it allows you to capture images, videos, attached documents. For, for this example, I'll just say I need review for this transaction. Click on approve. Because this required only performer level authentication, I was not prompted for a verifier level authentication. Let's take an example for verifier level authentication. I'll capture a value for this variable which require performer as well as verifier level authentication both because I've authenticated myself in previous transaction and I have configured my plant apps administrator that hold my credentials valid for next 30 minutes. So I will not be prompted for authenticating myself again. Now I can 